I'm doing breakfast for me and Stee, bacon and eggs, or a way for me to cut off the bacon as well. So welcome back to another video. I've just got ready. I had my coffee and breakfast as you would have seen. So today is Sunday. Today is usually the day that I just get stuff done. I would usually clean the house, go shopping, you know, meal prep if I'm going to meal prep. But today um, I don't need to clean the house. I just need to do a few bits and bobs, which I'll probably just do later because I've done all this yesterday. Um, but I am going to go food shopping, so I'm going to be writing a list of all the meals that I want this week. I'm probably going to switch up a few of my meals. And then we're going to go on a nice long walk, take the dog for a walk. So yeah, let's start this video by doing some meal planning. Here is my notebook. I just rip a page out and just write down all my meals. And then I'll just write down all the ingredients. Take this to the shop with me so I don't forget anything. I'm thinking I want to try some different meals this week. So I am currently on an eight week cut at the moment. So me and my boyfriend, we're doing it together. We're eating in a calorie deficit every single day for eight weeks. So we are now um, into week four at the start of this video. Um, I am gonna be doing an updated video on like a body check-in, how it's getting on, you know, measurements and stuff like that. So I'm very excited for that video next week. So obviously I need to be making healthy choices, lower calorie meals if possible, just makes more sense. But anyway, let's stop rambling and plan some meals. So I wrote my list, I'll show you what I'm gonna buy this week. By the way, if anyone is looking for a really good protein bar that tastes so good, the Trek Power Chocolate Orange, yes, this is by far the best one I've tried. It's, I think there's like 16 in here. Plant-based, gluten-free, 15 grams of protein, vegan, but it's it's not because I'm vegan or anything like that. It just honestly tastes amazing. So highly recommend these if you're on the hunt for something nice. So let's quickly go through the recipes that I've chosen. So some of these I'll make extra for lunch and some I've just wrote down what I'd have for lunch. So for lunches, I'm gonna mix between the prawn Caesar salads that I've been loving and tuna, mayo and onion baguettes love them and then the rest i'm going to do leftovers so i'm already thinking i don't know if i'm going to do meal prep if i do i'll do that tomorrow so i'll figure that out tomorrow if i need anything extra i'll have to go back to the shop but i'm thinking i'm just going to do leftovers from dinners so we do this butter belly bowl which is basically just like chicken noodles and sauce and stuff like that chicken fajitas katsu chicken curry love that sausage mashed veg and gravy that's just going to be a quick and easy dinner one night and then we're going to do a homemade lasagna steve's really good at that so he will do the lasagna and we'll definitely have leftovers from that so let's go shopping a protein bar it's a little snack before we go on a walk um i think i'm gonna have a coffee as well i've only had one coffee today so what time is it one o'clock one o'clock so i feel like we'll have the coffee have this right i used to love the phd protein bars and i haven't had one for ages the chocolate blondie was my favorite so i'm gonna try this now and see if i love it but the ones i showed you earlier are definitely my favorite
through some of the things that I've got for shopping this week. I've got some light cheddar, mozzarella, and there is some feta cheese and some cream cheese back there. Honestly, I've not drank alcohol for so long because we've been on this eight week cut. So I've had these bottles since my birthday, I've still not opened them. So I've got some single cream. I think I must need this for a recipe this week. So I've got some cooked ham. I like to have this as a snack, to be honest, or I might have it in a wrap or something. Radishes and cucumbers I'm using in a recipe. Sliced mushrooms and I like to get this fizzy, like zero sugar orange, just in case I fancy something fizzy. I absolutely love these as a quick snack. They are 98 calories sorry 89 calories and they honestly taste delicious so if you've seen any of my recent videos these king prawns with my caesar salad is absolutely delicious so this i've just got one of these probably end up going back to the shop for another one peppers and this is the iceberg lettuce i'm using for my caesar salad so all of the meats these mini fillet tenders this is for my um, noodle bowl that I am loving got some reduced fat sausages for sausage and mash I'm planning on having this week just three no four chicken breasts in here which I'm planning to have chicken fajitas with and the katsu chicken curry that I've got I like to use these breaded chicken steaks with these instead of fillet so I've got these also for the homemade lasagna that we're making which will suck, which will do six pieces just got 500 grams of this five percent fat steak mince so that is all of the meats this week this is like the treat drawer honestly i don't really have sweets but i like things like this which are these takeaway bars or if i don't have a takeaway bar i have these like square bars which are 140 calories other high protein snacks I absolutely love I'm sure you'd have seen these before so it's 17 grams of protein and this is 139 calories so this on the go is perfect for a low calorie high protein snack and then I always make sure I drink lots of water of course so I need to get through this night I've not drunk enough water today definitely Still always gets our introduced. I don't drink it. I just think it is so high in calories. I just don't end up drinking it. So I have been loving this combo red onions, the tuna chunks in spring water, not in oil, just less calories, and these seeded sourdough baguette breads. These are so good. It's about 500 calories for the onion, light mayonnaise, tuna, and this baguette, and it is so worth it. This is an absolute joke at the moment. I have so many things. This was so organised and now it is all over the place. So I like to get these just because they are so quick and easy to heat up in the microwave. I got this Frank's Red Hot Sauce because it is super low calorie. These are the Singapore noodles that we use for our chicken and noodle dish that we absolutely love these i had no clue you could buy these in the shop so instead of buying it in the pack this is what i get for the katsu chicken recipe kit and i also got this i'm not sure if i'm going to have it this week but it's the blue dragon satay noodles so you get all these seasonings and then you just add whatever meat and veg you want so i may try that this week for some healthy snack options i got this cup of soup but someone at work had them and i kept eating them they're only 95 calories 97 sorry another low calorie snack idea these little fiber neighbors salted caramel they are really small they're only 77 calories but i have it with this salted caramel it's 325 calories per tub um high in protein i don't know how high in protein a serving is but even just a quarter of this is really good calories so it's a really good dessert option if you have got a sweet tooth so i'm not a huge cereal fan but honestly 40 grams of this is a really good portion so if you're looking for something more calorie friendly for a good portion this cheerios multigrain is a really good option so i got these I actually do like the fruit and fibre but this is for stay and also as another low calorie snack the salt and vinegar flavour 78 calories so 
this will be another snack option for the week. So that was just a little haul of everything I got today and just some of my go-to snacks to keep me on track and you know making sure I've got snacks to keep me on track during the week because honestly that is when things go wrong like even if you don't meal prep as much or you know even if you do meal prep I feel like when you're hungry and it's in between meals I just need some sort of snack that's low calorie that's going to keep me going so what I've got what I've just shown you they're just like my go-to's so it is like seven o'clock now I'm going to put my headphones on put a podcast on got a bit of cleaning to do not too much and then I think I'm going to have a little self-care like a bath a face mask yes Love doing this on a Sunday, so this is what we're going to do right now. So now I can chill for the night. Hair is off, the bath is running, if you can hear. So I'm just going to quickly cleanse and exfoliate. So I just used the Teamy cleanser. I'm almost out of this. So sad, I've got other Teamy products as well. So this is definitely by far my favourite cleanser. It's so nice. Um, yeah, so if you want to get 20% off, I'll link that down below. Then I've got the Body Shop Vitamin C Glow Revealing Liquid Peel. So I'm just using this as my exfoliator. You were my best friend. Didn't care about the rules, good on the weekends. I'll be in fools, drifting the deep space. So brave and so stupid, just like the movies. How it's gonna stay in the fire. Face is so red right now, but I'm just gonna put a face mask on. So I've got two different types of face masks that I usually go for. One for when I've got more oily skin or like breakouts, but this one is more for like nourishing, hydrating. So it's the fresh plumping mask from the body shop. This on, this feels so nice. It's like basically like a clear colour. If I'm not using that mask, my next go-to is the Teamy Detox Mask. Yeah, I just feel like my skin needs a bit of hydration. And this one is like really, really nice and hydrating. So I've actually got a blush bath bomb. So I'm very excited to use that. It's good and smells so good. I think I'm going to light my candle. Watch a bit of YouTube. If I've got a series, I'll put like an episode on. But I think I'm just going to watch some YouTube in the bath today. This is the body scrub that I'm going to use and this is the shower gel that I'm going to use which smells so so nice. And that skincare was so needed i'm feeling nice and glowy right now i am actually halfway through this orange oh my god i actually look so red so this is the cup of soup the one i showed you earlier it looks like it looks like milk it actually looks horrible but it does taste nice and then i've just got these pack of snacker jacks for after so this is my little evening snack i'll definitely go and grab my water i need to go drink some more water and that is me for the night so i'm just going to go ahead and end this video here make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one